But this thing, the J-29D, might be the ugliest jet fighter I've ever set my eyes on. Fat, overweight, cumbersome. The gear... No, okay. No, a lot of planes have that. But just because it's this big, the gear is buckled, which means that it can't support its own weight, but it has been designed to support its own weight. I'm just going to carry on. It's just huge, but it's also small. So this is, I mean, to me, when I first look at this, I think of the TA-183, the uh, German wonder weapon, or what do you want to call those things? I don't even know what was built, but it looks like that. It also looks like a squished, a squished MiG. And I don't know why they designed it like this. They could have elongated it a little bit, maybe incorporated this a little bit higher. I'm no aircraft engineer or designer. I'm just saying there's a lot of unused space in this aircraft, or at least just two things I've noticed. One is that why not put some of the fuel in the wings to lower the uh, top silhouette? Two, why not just have two Aiden cannons or Akin, A-K-A-N. These are, I think, the same thing. Two's good. I mean, four is better, but two's okay. You could get rid of these up here um, and then potentially lower the ammunition to squish the squish the jet down a little bit to make it more aer aerodynamic. It is a small aircraft. And it's not like that they couldn't put, I mean, a lot of jets used fuel in their wings. I mean, we'll just go to the, we can go to the F-100. It's, it's all in the wings. Well, it has a little bit of fuselage there. Uh, the F-86 has had, you know, so it wasn't like it wasn't possible. And that, and, and, I, and I'm not trying to insult, because here in America, we have a lot of fat things, including things that walk on two legs. I'm just saying that there's a lot of, there's a lot of space that uh, could have been um, made smaller. Now, again, I don't know the restrictions, the technology at the time. I'm just saying in 2020 retrospect, hindsight, this is what I know. Now, this is the first Swedish jet in the game. And uh, word on the streets, it is bad for its BR. Any plane can be great if it has a decent BR. This one, on the other hand, is bad. And I feel like it has to come down to probably its acceleration. Turn time, just by looking at this thing, has to be decent. I mean, there's so much, uh, there's so much surface.